Yo, what is going on everybody? It's your boy Gripper back here with another video for you guys today. In this video, we're going to be discussing 2022 Topps Chrome retail prices were revealed and they are exactly what you thought they were going to be. But before we get into that, let's plug the giveaway. As usual, we're going to be giving away a mega box of 2021 Topps Platinum Chrome Anniversary. All you guys need to do is be subscribed, like this video, turn on post notifications, comment your favorite moment in the MLB this far, and go stream my new song. Link's in the description after this video. Check it out. If you like it, guess what? We have a new one coming out August 26th. So make sure you do all that, and there you go. But, man, today's video is interesting. Um, so a buddy of mine is in a Discord group, and apparently what this Discord... I, I didn't even know these existed until, like, tonight. Um, what they are, are they're, like, bots that will detect when, like, sports cards go up on, like, Walmart, Target, like, all these different retail sites. And Topps Chrome went up for pre-order on a particular website tonight, and I clicked the link just to see how much it would be, and the price didn't shock me for one single second. So let's get into it. So tonight, my buddy sent me a link to Dick's Sporting Goods. It's a sporting goods store, at least here around in like the um, northeastern part of the state. There's like, I think, two or three of them by me. Um, but so... They've been selling sports cards now, I think, starting this year. They just started selling. Like, I think they got the Topps contract this year. So, Topps just started selling sports cards at Dick's Sporting Goods, um, like, this year, right? And the other prices for the product are reasonable. Like, a blaster box of Series 1 was uh, $20. Uh, Series 2 was $25. So, these are, like, these are legit prices. Like, the price I'm going to tell you for 2022 Topps Chrome Blaster Box is will be like that's accurate so before we get into it i'm gonna give you guys 10 seconds i'm gonna count down i want you to comment your prediction to how much you think these blaster boxes are so i'll give you 10 9 8 7 6 5 4 3 2 and 1 hope you guys got your guesses in because guess what if you guessed 42.99 you would be correct you heard that correct, guys. $42.99. That's not including tax or shipping, by the way, online. So let's say you're buying online. That's almost $50 a blaster box for 2022 Tops Chrome. Unbelievable. Did I not tell you guys a couple months ago? I just told you this the other week. I guarantee you... Topps Blaster Boxes for Chrome will be anywhere between $35 and $40. They actually exceeded my expectation and went up a little bit. Now, that might just be an online price. You know, they might be $40 in stores. Like, Target may sell them for like $37.99. Walmart will probably go $40 as well. I cannot believe we're in the day and age, in the, in the age where a Blaster Box of baseball cards are forty dollars and in case you were wondering a uh hobby box of series two is 99 dollars. so <laughs> i can't believe this i knew i was gonna come on here and make a video one of these days about the price because i knew this was gonna happen as soon as they saw panini selling 40 dollar blasters at meyer for optic football um that I knew, I knew right then and there, right then and there, that the uh, Chrome would be around forty dollars. Does this shock anybody? Because I know if you guys are a long time subscriber of mine, I've been predicting this ever since the first price increase. Ever since the first price increase with uh, Heritage, in fact, I've said I guarantee you, Topps Chrome will be anywhere between thirty and forty dollars a blaster box, and I was right. I was right yet again. There is another check mark for the good old Gripper Rip scorecard of being correct. Every time I've said something, it's turned into it's turned to truth, and it's very upsetting. I I, I knew this was going to happen. I just it was only a matter of time, you know. The new I, I I'd have to guess the new blaster box price is going to be like thirty two dollars. 
So, you know, it's ridiculous. I can guarantee you, I don't even know when the next retail release is. It's supposedly tops Heritage High number, supposedly. But is it really going to be? I have no idea. On DickSportingGoods.com, which, by the way, those blasters sold out in less than five minutes. So whoever bought them, yeah, good luck with them. I can guarantee you, the, I, I just feel bad for you. Because, honestly... If the big three rookies of Julio, like all the other, like, you know, they're not, there's like five of them, really. But if all the big Series 2 rookies and Series 1 rookies are in Chrome, just buy the singles. Really, I mean, just, just buy the singles. Sure, they might be like $20 or $30 a piece. But would you rather buy a single or spend $30 to $40, a blaster box, that has probably, I don't even know how many, I completely forget how many bladder cards are in a blaster box. I think it's 46. That number just sticks out in my head. Um, yeah, so you're basically paying a dollar for a card there. I mean, if you get really lucky, I'm, I'm sure a lot of people will get lucky finding the one of the big five, really. So you have O'Neal, Wander, J-Rod, Bobby Witt, and Spencer Torkels. And if you even want to consider him in the big five, really, because he's in AAA now. But, you know... It's a shame. and I'm just going to buy singles. I am not going to spend a single dime on a blaster box. You will never, I, I, I could promise you this, you will never see me uh, with a retail pickup video of, of me holding a blaster box of chrome in my hand. If I buy something chrome related, it's going to be a single. I am not, and I repeat, I am not going to buy a blaster box. Now, maybe I'll buy a cello pack. The cello pack and the hanger box prices have not been revealed but if I had to guess, just by judging off the $40 price, I'd probably have to say a cell pack will be anywhere between $15 and $20, and a hanger box will probably be somewhere in the middle there of $30. It's 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 insane, guys. I, I knew this day would come. I'm not, you know, I'm not surprised at all. It was just a matter of time, again. And the prices for blaster boxes going forward, I guarantee you are probably gonna be in the $32 to $35 range if Chrome's $40. Because I remember last year, they uh, they increased Chrome to $25. And that's the current price today. But, you know, it, it's just a shame, guys. It, it really is a shame. So let's get into the pack here. Hopefully we could pull a short print, which at this point, I'm not even, <laughs> I'm not even you know, I'm not buying any more Series 2. So the Series 2 I have is the Series 2 that I'll just open and you know, I'm not going to buy anymore. So Ryan Sandberg and Xander Bogart, who is opting out of his contract this year. So he'll be a free agent. So, and no short print. Why do these cards look like they're oversaturated? Did anyone notice that? Might just be me. These cards look... Oh, look. <laughs> there is the... Uh, hold on. Let's, let's show you this, guys. So here is the current... Here is the uh, quote-unquote error version. Here is the corrected version are they oversaturated these cards holy crap look at that they are oversaturated but anyways let's get, let me get out of here guys i just wanted to let you know about the price increase of 2022 tops chrome retail i mean i don't know if this stuff will sit on the shelves probably not because it's chrome but let me know what you think about this are you going to be buying any uh retail chrome if so how much i'm very interested to hear what you guys have to think about this and I'll see you guys in the next one.